From Soldiers Radio and Television, this is the Army Today, a daily feature from around the globe. When U.S. troops liberated the Buchenwald concentration camp in April of 1945, what they saw was beyond imagination. The images of suffering and death would last a lifetime. Just as those U.S. troops entering Buchenwald witness history, Americans today have the same chance. I think, I think it is really pretty vital to understanding history. It's one thing to read it in a book, but then to come and walk the grounds, it's definitely a more lively experience. You can, you can see conditions or understand the magnitude of something far more than reading in a book. The Equal Opportunity Office on the Wiesbaden Army Airfield provided troops and their families a first-hand emotional tour through history. I felt very sad, just, um, I guess there's really not a scripted word enough to, to say what that feeling is, it's just, it's real, like it, it kind of hits you when you walk in that room, it hit me, <laughs> just sadness. According to the Holocaust Memorial Museum, 50,000 people lost their lives while suffering imprisonment at the Buchenwald concentration camp. These Americans and thousands of others who visit here every year come not just to remember the past, but also in the hope that what happened here will never be repeated again. Army Sergeant Marlon Stiles, Weimar, Germany. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television in Washington, D.C. 